Hey, hey guys, uh, you guys are off on the coronavirus, uh, can't be here, it's a real bummer. So uh, I thought I'd uh, show you the progress here. Uh, vacuum gauge, still showing some vacuum from last time. Let me pop that off. Oh, yeah. There's a gauge, I'm not sure you can see it in, uh, in the camera. Uh, but anyway, so uh, this thing's gonna suck down onto the granite. I got a, just a piece of aluminum to cap it with. So I'll watch the gauge and we'll see what happens. The cool thing is, watch this thing when I turn the pump on, it's going to go and suck down. So here we go. Turn this thing on, get my arm out of the way, and here we go. <laughs> so there's almost total vacuum. I'll turn this guy off. To watch how this gauge moves over time so it's it's holding a really good vacuum which is really cool so the other one with the uh, 3d printed tpu o-rings uh, not so much it hold a vacuum for about 20 seconds maybe this one just real slowly loses vacuum in fact you can see when we first started it was up there about uh, 15 inches of mercury and that's after sitting here for maybe 10 minutes so and this thing, oh! And I think the reason it releases is if I pull on one edge, it lets go like that. So. So, yeah, it's, it's, I did it with this block in the center and you can almost pick up this piece of granite with it. So the granite's, I don't know, I'd have to weigh it, I'm thinking at least 40 pounds maybe. So I'll have to do some tests to make sure, but I think I'm gonna start banging these guys out. I got all the tool pads, just a matter of uh, making a bunch of them now. So I'll make uh, five more just like this one. So we can daisy chain them all together and have six in total. That's it, wish you boys were here. Talk to you later.